So today we had a little bit of an accident. You will see. Stick around till the end to see the whole story. I'm okay, but I saw something. So yeah, it was pretty scary. <laughs> Good morning, guys. It's Friday. I didn't do my temple yesterday. I was a bad girl. <laughs> my uncle was bothering me a little bit. So I decided to give it a rest. I walked my dog. So I put on like probably three miles, something like that. But I wanted just my uncle not to have the pressure of doing a tempo run. Um, so today we're doing the 10 miler. It's kind of late, so I'm gonna have to boot it as quickly as possible here get the run started and um, yeah 950 base marathon approaching quickly I released a bunch of videos this week guys we're still doing vlogtober hopefully you tune in for more videos so and give this one a huge thumbs up if you enjoy content like this one I would love for you to support my channel if you could if you feel like this content is valuable so Let's start running, shall we? I'm going too fast, guys. Four. I need to slow down. Man. Five. And this one's too slow. So, I just got the scariest moment of my life. Not quite, but almost. That's why I'm walking. My heart rate went all the way up. So, there were two women walking their dogs. One of them had two dogs, one of them a German Shepherd. She was just walking on one side of the street and the other one was walking on the other side. And the woman with the German Shepherd, the German Shepherd saw the other dog across the street and just shot out like super fast, put her on the ground, like took her on the ground. She and the other dog she had on the ground and just like, all through the, the road oh my god and then she was like help me help me the other dog went her dog her German Shepherd went towards the other dog because the other one didn't even have time like to just run away it was so and she was like help me help me how the heck do you help a person like that with an aggressive dog Finally, the dog stopped and she, I mean, I stopped from a distance because you never know what a dog like that is going to do. So I stopped, my heart like boom, 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 boom. And then she finally managed to stop the dog and stand up and just sat there on the ground. And she was okay. She said, I'm okay. But so scary because, you know, these streets are like big and she, the dog just took her on the ground. So I'm gonna tell my my husband. I'm gonna tell my husband not to walk any today. I don't know. I've seen this woman before with that those with both dogs, and um, I don't know. Just scary. <laughs> I 
didn't see the woman and her two dogs again. But thinking about the whole scene and how it happened, I think she was a dog walker because she had absolutely no control over the dog, over the German Shepherd. And she kept saying, help me, help me. I, you know, if my dog were to attack someone, which she would never do, I mean, she's such a sweet dog, I would never say, help me. I would call her name repeated times and I would say no repeated times and that's it. So, yeah, I don't know. I hope the other dog was okay because the German Shepherd got very close to the other dog, so I don't know. But I ran around and it only took me like two minutes to come around and they were not there anymore. So I think if they had called the police or anything like that, they would have been there still. So, so anyway, that's it for my 10 miler. I didn't do bad despite having to stop, but that stop and then I, I think I stopped in a weird position and now my foot is hurting again. So I'm gonna ice it and recover, maybe foam roll a little bit. Well, actually roll with the ball. It's gonna be the best thing to do. Okay guys, let me know how your training is going. Give this video a huge thumbs up, share with your friends, and I'll see you in the next video. Run fearless. Yeah.